This young lady came to us for Botox. She'd had a bad experience somewhere else because her Botox was too heavy. And so when I'm doing an assessment for Botox, I'm looking at a couple of things. I'm looking to see where is the eyelid on the lash line. And you can see hers is already touching. So to have any more laxity here is really going to be counterproductive. So I like to do what I call the circle. So I look to see where the crease is in the procerus, and that's my first injection point. I go straight up from the intercanthus of their eye. That's my second injection point. And I can already tell that she's not a good candidate for the outer triangle. And so instead of putting it here, I'm going to hit the other end of the corrugator. So this is actually the corrugator. So we did this two weeks ago. Go ahead and be angry for me. So you can see she has a little bit of a movement here from the tail of her corrugator that I didn't hit, but it's not enough to actually squish this together. And what's going to happen then is that she's going to relax your face. She's actually gonna get a little lift in her eye and she'll see a little bit of more of her eyelid here and that will help round out her eyebrows as well. So for people that have really flat eyebrows or have a lot of tissue here, that's going to help.